Hi. Today I want to talk about the first time that I went to Japan. Uh, it's a story about the first meal that I ever had. And this kind of pattern that you listen to, you can perhaps use when you want to talk about the first time uh, that you did something. So I was in my early 20s when I first went to Japan and I was, uh, I was very nervous when I stepped out of the hotel that I was staying in as I went to look for something to eat for the first time. I, I couldn't uh, speak or uh, read Japanese at all so I wandered around uh, the local streets looking for somewhere to go in and eventually I found what I thought was a kind of Chinese restaurant uh, that was serving various kinds of meals. Um, I chose that restaurant because outside it had plastic models of the food so I could guess uh, what they were. So I went inside uh, the, the shop and I gestured to uh, a young man who was working there to come outside and then I pointed at uh, one of the models uh, to indicate what I, I wanted to eat and he understood and we both went back inside uh, the restaurant. Uh, within a few minutes I was eating some kind of noodles. Um, I didn't know what they were called at the time but they were delicious and since then uh, I uh, found out that they were uh, called ramen. Uh, at the time I didn't know what ramen was but now I think ramen is a very well-known dish inside Japan and also outside Japan and I have liked ramen uh, ever since that day. So uh, that was my story about eating uh, ramen for the, the first time in Japan and I hope that you could uh, understand the main points. Um, what you can do is look at the, the script um, below uh, the video and you could listen again and follow along. Uh, what you might notice is that when you tell a story there are various parts to the story um, one, of, one of the first parts is to give a little bit of background. So uh, in this case, I was, I was in my early 20s. Uh, it was my first time in Japan. Uh, I couldn't speak uh, or read Japanese. So that's a little bit of background. And then you move into the, into the action. And so uh, my action was involved walking around the streets and uh, finding a Chinese restaurant with plastic models of food outside. And um, finally, the, the, the sort of final part is what, what's the message uh, of the story? And, and in this case, the message was um, the, the link between the first time I had ramen and, and now. And I have liked uh, ramen ever since that time. So I hope you enjoyed the story and uh, please uh, use the information to uh, inform your own stories about the first time that you do something.